situation. Um, is any game in terms of football? Uh, just more rehab, more recovery stuff to get back to this game. Yeah, that's pretty disappointing. Um, a game with this magnitude and um, the amount of fight that we've put in together as a team since January last year after the bowl game. Uh, and, you know, it all came down to this game, the game, and then um, the way it played out, incredible game. Short. Steve on the left. Up and down. Uh, it was a struggle. Um, you know, I got stopped on the low line. And the coach to call on me again to you know, go back and do it again. I was going to trust you guys as players. Um, you know, it's not about my success, though. I mean, we wanted to get a dub as a team. We go short. Uh, you know, we got to keep our heads up and keep moving. Same a lot. I made a couple mistakes in the game. Um, Fortunate to get the my hand hit, you know, when I was thrown out of my end zone, uh, which resulted in pick six, um, and you know, trying to force another ball into a too tight of a window. <coughs> um, but yeah, yeah. Um, we just need to do that again in the second overtime, <coughs> and uh, we were not able to do that. Kenny made a good field goal. Pretty sure the defense made a stop, but they didn't, according to the replay. So she um, came up a little short. The coach has a strict policy about not talking about injuries. Um, trainers and the doctors and every, everyone uh, did their part to get me ready to go for this game. Who robbed on the spot? Yeah, it happens in the game. You know, just. Some calls are not made, some plays, you know, you just don't think, oh, well, you we want it. And then the ref calls something different, but it happens in every football game. Um, you got to be able to just go to the next play. But like I said, Phillips fell short at the end of the team. And more can get past him. Uh, yeah, it crossed my mind. It flashed the two up. Probably, you guys probably saw that. But um, it's probably a smarter play to go for one. Yeah. Uh, it's a bummer, you know. I feel like I let the defense down for the game that they played. Um, it, it stings throughout the rest of the game. And uh, we were able to capitalize on it in the first ever time. And um, second ever time, you know, I, I'm not going to get in, into the, the calls and, and the, that the refs are making, so we'll just leave it there. Come on, on top. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, when my when my name is called upon, I, you know, I think I have one job, so go out and do it. And I know we didn't capitalize on every single pun, but I mean, you know, the team fought hard today, and you know, I'm proud of them. And, you know, but you know, like Wilton said, you know, we lost, and you know, we had chances to capitalize where we didn't. Uh, I'm sure a lot of people saw that, but um, yeah, saw that. Ab absolutely. Um, you know, with Alabama, arguably the country in the country, so um, I don't know how it's all going to shake out uh, with the committee and all that. I'm sure our chances are slim to none now, but um, it's a bummer that. Another shot at those guys this year. Okay. Saw Iowa turn it around. They didn't start in Nebraska yesterday. Um, that was just a weird game, a weird night. Um, and then you see you know, two heavyweight um, teams go into to double overtime. I think that speaks volumes for you know, a chance at the playoffs. And that was, I mean, there, I think there was a little miscommunication with the, the crowd noise and. Um, I should have stayed in there longer, knowing that there might be, um, you know, problems with, you know, how loud it was. So that, yeah, that's on me. <laughs> the work we put in as a team, you know, doesn't amount to one loss.
can't one loss. You can't let one loss just hurt. You know the season. We lost on Iowa. We moved on. We lost, we lost to Iowa State today. We'll move on. You know we won't let one loss define us. Yes, it sucks losing to Iowa State, but one loss will not define us as a team.